Today I want to show you my favorite pet, a little lionfish. What? Okay, okay, okay. Hello and welcome to Sea Friendly Reef featuring Mr. Swim Shady. Where are you? Man, he's behind his favorite place. Before starting into this video, I have to tell you these type of fish are enormously venomous, so please be careful. Remember that before buying some of these fish, the thumbnail was not a joke. It can kill you, for example, if you've got an allergy. So think about that. Mr. Swim Shady is a short fin lionfish, so this is a special type of lion fish which is not growing so big like the other one so it's perfect for keeping it in an aquarium if you are thinking about buying one of these fish I can tell you this is one of the most fascinating animals I've ever owned it's just like a little dog but underwater you know what I mean <laughs> every time when I came home he's waiting on the water surface and watching what's going on Toby do you've got some food for me please it's so sweet the best time to film a lionfish is at night. During the day this animal often retreats to quieter places. But don't worry, you'll see your lionfish swimming around during the day as well, especially when there is some food. The 18 venomous spine that spurt over the body contain the poison. However, lionfish do not use them for hunting. They protect themselves from enemies and put up the deadly fins in case of danger. Everyone who has ever been stung has told me how incredibly painful it was. That's why I'm always extra careful. If it works out, I always do some smaller tasks in the aquarium with the pliers. And if I have to move something, I watch him very well. This species is enormously curious but never aggressive, so you don't have to be afraid that they will attack you. That is total nonsense. Still, I don't want to hurt the animal or myself. Some of you may remember the scene in the video together with Toby, where he feeds his lionfish with his hands. He knows exactly what he's doing, but I would not recommend it to you. When I put Mr. Swim Shady in the aquarium, I decided to not use a net. I didn't want that animal to get caught in it. I dumped him into the water with the whole bag. I'm not supposed to do that, I know, but I did not care. In nature, these animals often come together in small groups, especially for mating. In the aquarium, it is no problem to keep them alone. As soon as I approach the water surface, this happens. What's up, man? Whee! Okay, 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 okay! Keep cool. I often feed it with frozen shrimp or live food. It is important here to thaw the food well. Lionfish can digest their food even if half of it's still hanging out of their mouth. I've been warned by someone that lionfish will be eat everything that fits in their mouth. But in my experience, they will only eat that is new to the aquarium. And here it doesn't matter what, because I wanted to add a gubby, it was around 5 cm bigger than Mr. Swim Shady. And a day later it was gone and he needed a little diet. But he always leaves his housemates alone that have lived in the tank from the beginning. My lionfish lives in that 300 liter tank. So I think for right now it is okay because it is about 8 to 9 centimeters big and it has many hiding places here. Next to that there are not many other fish inside. Thank you very much for watching this video. Feel free to subscribe and otherwise see you next week.